Hi friends, welcome to my kitchen. Today we are going to prepare palak kadi. For that we need buttermilk. Our buttermilk we need for this, and it's approximate half a liter. And next ingredients we need is this is spinach. Okay, you can use the fresh one if you have, but I am using the frozen one. Four pieces of that. So it might be I think two fifty grams in the buttermilk. One four teaspoon of turmeric. I'm just adding and showing you. And then I'll add same one fourth teaspoon of red chili. One fourth teaspoon. Then to this I will add some flour or basin. And that I'm going to add is almost one. I will just mix it nicely. We want a lump free. You can do this in the mixer also. You can add all these things and just mix it for I think just for one to two seconds. That's all. And it will be fine. Um, now we will uh, prepare for the tempering. Okay. For that we need four whole green chilies. I will add in this. Then I will add one inch of ginger. One fourth teaspoon of cumin seeds, and now I will grind it and make a coarse paste. Just grind it coarsely. Now we will start tempering. Here the pan is heating. To this I'll add one tablespoon of oil. To this I will add a pinch of asafoetida. Now to this I I will add one fourth teaspoon of mustard seeds. Then I'll add fenugreek seeds. We will not add too much, less than uh, one fourth teaspoon. Because if we add too much, it will give a bitter taste. And then to this, I will add two dry red chilies, and then the ginger, green chili, and cumin seed. What I have just coarsely grinded, I'll add to this. I've added. Then I will add little bit of curry leaf. I saute it for two to three minutes so that the rawness of the ginger and green chili just goes. One and a half teaspoon of salt. Yeah, I will add it. Now to this, I will just throw my frozen spinach. It will automatically melt. That's all. It is more than enough. Now to this, I will add. And we have prepared the buttermilk mixture. Slowly, slowly, I will add to this. And give a good mix like this. Okay, and in a medium flame, we will cook this curry. This is a very healthy dish, and it's prepared in no time. Good for kids because kids don't like green vegetables, so it's a very good dish for them. You can make this, serve this with steamed rice. When the curry <coughs> start boiling, at that time I'll add little bit salt. Because I have just added the salt in the spinach, not in the curry. And now the curry is ready. After uh, first boil, we continued boiling for another 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes. 
in a low flame and then now you can serve it 